the money I left on that table this morning just disappear. Honor. My princess. Where is the money? My princess, I didn't see any money. You did not see any money. Yes, my princess. Assemble all the maids. Now! Yes, my princess. all of you took the money I left on the table this morning. Not me, princess. I don't know. I said, who amongst all of you took the money I left on the table this morning? No. Oh, the money grew wings and flew away just like that. Get out. Funny anymore. I mean, this is getting serious. What is it? And who will be bold enough to go into the princess room and take the money she dropped on her dressing table? So, did the money disappear? <laughs> or are you trying to say that princess doesn't know what she's talking again? God forbid, ma. That is not what I said, though. Hmm. <laughs> I pray that this does not affect the innocent ones. I wonder. Ha! Huh. Why the main culprit goes free? We all know Princess Ebiri and what she can do. I just pray she catches the thief, or else we all are doomed. I beg you, I don't want to suffer for a crime I know nothing about. No way. Amen. No way. Amen. Ah. Oh, it's too much. It's getting too much. Seriously. Hey, you want Iwe, Hey, The day has not brought out your usual glow. Who in this kingdom is responsible for this? If I knew I would have dealt with it, I wouldn't be bothering you. My money has been stolen again, my father. Again? But you know, it's amazing that this only happens in your chambers. Does that suggest I'm careless? No, 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 no. Far from it. It only caused me to wonder about the diligence and the effectiveness of your chief mate. Father, honor has been with me for over six years. I have absolutely no reason whatsoever to doubt her faithfulness. Well, you may be right, my Joel. But in human affairs, human faithfulness calls for regular review. That you will learn. I know, but... It is, it is difficult to imagine that she could be behind all the theft. Very. Yeah, it is. It is so. But, be rest assured of this, my dear. If the thief has been stealing for 1,000 years, one day, just one day, the girls will visit him or her with vengeance and justice. Just one day. Thank you, my father. Fresh enough, my dear. You know you are my joy. Thank you. Oh, 
I thought you won't make it tonight. What kept my love? My dear, tension in the palace over the loss of my princess. Mom. Well, but what does that have to do with the love we share? Ah, the princess happiness defines my mood. True, but I know. But begin to think about when your mood will be defined by the love we have to ah. share. <laughs> I can't wait for that time to come. Well, you suppose it begins tonight? Eche, it begins every night and ends every morning. Well, you never can tell what tomorrow holds in the picture. What if I stumble on gold right now and we leave this kingdom and make the world of our own? Yeah, you know you dream big. <laughs> I just hope I... they come through one day. Let's start from somewhere first. Ubiadana! Uh... <laughs> Let it start from somewhere first. Eche, stop! Uh, you want to wake up the whole palace? Shh! Let me go and give it to you. Come, 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 come. Stop. Come. Who be that, Ada? Your Royal Majesty. It's no secret in the kingdom how difficult it was for me to train my only son. The only son I have after my husband's death. Now! He has grown to manhood. This witch, this witch cut down his life! Godness, all of is my only child. There's a feeling that she has in her self-defense. How? How is it possible that she can match a strong man like all that? Liar! No, liar. liar like you! She planned to kill my son, your majesty! This witch planned to kill my son! She took him on her ways! The majesty, this is incredible. Nuswana! The world is becoming more wicked by the day, your highness. The verdict is clear. And if we delay justice, it will send the wrong signal to our women folk. Yes, to kill any young man that greets them on the way. Yes! How can a man that tells me that he loves me grabs me and tears off my clothes? Your Majesty, I had no choice. I never knew he was going to die. I never knew. I'm sorry. You mean you really stabbed him to death? Eh? Huh? <laughs> Let me tell you. Self-defense or not, our laws Say, death for death. Period. Your Highness, please. Do not blind your only eye with witches. But she blinded my witches. Look at them. Enough. Witches. Enough. Enough of this battery. My chiefs have spoken. And in line with the tradition of my people. I hereby declare I want more. Mama! 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 Oh, please help me, I'm begging you, please. I beg you, please help me. Oh, God, your mother, detain her. I'll make sure that she's revived. I come out of I come out of the way. I come out of the way. I why he seek a yambu abo odendo on kama uwo banya joka my father i thought you were asleep i believe you were sleeping Sleep seems to have taken flight suddenly for a reason I can't understand. There's nothing to understand. Two deaths and, well, what I may call miscarriage of justice. Well, that's their fate. And fate, my dear, no one can do anything about. But what is this about justice? My father. We cannot do anything about fate. But it's in your power to do something about justice. Oh, you're referring to the girl. Well, the laws of our land are quite straightforward about that. Indeed. 
but the laws are exercised in the doctrine of justice. Was it just for the boy to rape her? Is that our law? That was her word against his, which cannot be confirmed, unfortunately, because the boy is now dead. Think about it, my father. The girl could not have overpowered him and stabbed him if he was not on the wrong side of the law. He was an animal for attempting to rape her. Well, that is why Sleep has suddenly taken flight. I think about it all night. But there is never a reason good enough for murder. Yeah. The girl was right, my father. She didn't have murder at the back of her mind. But our law, but our laws... Father, our laws were made by men. And it is only reasonable for them to amend it when necessary. If you say the law, it becomes injustice. The law should always ensure justice, my father. But my people, my chiefs, they you don't are the custodian, it. not them. Whatever you pronounce today will become antecedents that will reverberate through generations yet unborn. Nobody remembers the people or the chiefs. It's a very difficult situation. There are times to modify laws, break protocols, and waive policies. Now is such a time, my father. You may go to sleep now, my jewel. Yes, my father. My babe, go ahead and drink it. Eh? It will help to ease the pains. It's a good heart for pains. Please. Please. Hmm? Try. Take it. Okay. Let's do that. <coughs> My king, before 30 minutes, she will sleep off. Let no one disturb her. By the gods, she will be all right. I shall go to the forest and collect more herbs. I shall return this evening to see how she is faring. Thank you. Testing my patience. The eagle. The eagle that sees everything and flies high. And yours. My eyes are burning. My eyes are burning so much that all I see is the pain of my jewel. And to think that my own child is in there, in her stomach, suffering. You will we feel your pain. No, you don't. Yes. I can't. No. How can you possibly feel my pain? Your Highness. Anoliasa, at least we can understand how you feel. That is why I would suggest that since it has, it appears I have reached the limit of my capability, it is expedient we look beyond Mbuzu for remedy. Your Highness, the words give me hope no more. There is hope beyond here. Your Highness, and we we'll look for that hope, and the gods will guide us. I think I have lost every understanding of how your herbs work. Igwe, medicine is my foot, and I will seek that hope, and the gods will guide me through. Then go now. What are you waiting for? Go everywhere, anywhere, and bring back my life. <laughs> 
I got one. Pull now. Oh, but the police are. As helpless as a kanga here. The kanga? Uh, Is this the hope beyond my kingdom you talked about? Uh, uh, Take this stranger out of my face now. Uh, 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 I say it's strange. Let's go, let's go. I seem to keep hope alive. Let's go. Your Highness, some illness takes time to heal. Two weeks is enough time for a good heart to take effect, don't you think? No, no, not this. No, not this one. As I was taught by my father, a good herb needs time to work. This for my herbs needs time to work. Patient is the word, my. Patience is the word, my lord. How I have come to hate that word, patience. Hmm? The king guy. Your Highness. This young man is wasting my time. Go beyond this kingdom and fetch me the hope you promised. The king guy. Hmm? Malifi. Malifi! That it will heal. With time, my herbs will work. I told you I lost my hold and you come and do the same thing. This is uh, the king of the vultures. The great medicine man for our Aquara community. He has come to do his best. Yes, your highness. Yes. Your highness, I plead that you give me the chance to try my medicine on the pain to see if it will work out. Yes, your highness. I am not a king friendly with the world trial. What I need is assurance. My king. This is no time for trial and error. In a few weeks time, my queen is due to put to bed and you're here talking about trial and error. You get her? Malife. Malife! If you cannot give me the assurance, then clear out of my palace. You get me okay?
Jesus. What is it? My king, all is not well. My queen of the child. The queen couldn't make it my king. Oh, brother! Bad news. What are these bad news that strike me at heart like a burning spear? Happy. Oh, my dear, and you are still not sleeping. I came to check on you. Okay. Um, how is your brother, Ulama? He is fast asleep, but you are not sleeping. Yes, my dear. I'm not sleeping because I lost my jewel. Do you want to die for her? Well, no, but I'm not sure things will be the same again. I used to think that you love me. Of course I do love you. If you truly love me, you won't leave me. I will, I will never leave you. Hmm? You are my jewel. I will never leave you. Hmm? Do you love me? Yes. Come close to me. I love you. You are my jewel. And I will never leave you.
now you can sleep. Hmm? Yeah. I'll check on you early in the morning before the go grows. Alright? Thank you, I'm grateful. Thank you. I got my if I am on a four, I got my baggy bear, Waiting for Densi is like waiting for a fruit to ripe. He is not always punctual. So let us begin this meeting now. Obi, this thing Udensi is doing is getting out of hand. Why should Udensi always keep elders waiting? Why? This is unacceptable. When will he ever grow up? You talk as if you don't know him. Eliopod never changes his spots. No, I had to put a few things in place in my farm. That is why you see me late. We all are loafers here. None of us here has farm. None of us has farm. To... None of us has farm to put something in place. Udensi, you must grow up. I will. I will. We will not always tolerate this year lads. It. It's enough. That is why I pleaded guilty. Okay, never, never mind. I promise it will never happen again. I, I hope you are okay now. Uh huh. Now to the business at hand. We all know the tragedy that befell Nega, our late brother's wife. Obi. The real tragedy is that of her daughter, who stabs people and killing her mother in the process of one eh? Udoku. Udoku. Let's not give our daughter a bad name. You know, it's unfair. It's unfair. What other name can you give a mother? Huh? They call her mother. Uh -huh. huh. I heard she acted on self-defense, which you can even do if you were in her shoes. You then see you came late here. So stop pulling us back. We are not here to debate on her cute or otherwise. No. We are here to talk about her barrier. Because the king has instructed that we keep her body from decomposing. So we are here to talk how to raise money and bury her. That's a problem. Because myself, <laughs> I have to wait till harvest to raise money. You've just spoken my mind before. Oh, I spent everything on, on, on Yam siblings. Oh, I, I've spent it. But uh, we, we have to bury her, sir. Of course. Eh? She must be buried. Yeah. We either go borrowing or selling properties. A corpse must be buried and according to tradition. You didn't sleep in your room last night. Honor, are you going to tell me where? But my princess, I slept in my room. You were not in your room last night, because I checked for you there. I slept in my room, my princess. So, I'm lying, isn't it? Probably when I went to the maid's room, my princess. You were not there, because I checked for you there as well. Maybe when I went outside to catch some air, I was feeling sick. Are you telling me the truth? I'm sorry, but... Honor, never ever lie to me. If you want me to continue to trust you, never lie to me. Yes, my princess. Go and check on His Majesty. Yes, my princess. I'm not What did the the money lender mean by not lending money to the cops? Why do you ask me? You should go and ask him. Where 
are you not the one that took me there? Okay, the Obi, God of our land. Now, now tell me, how long do we leave the corpse unburied? Neka and Ulo have been a thorn on our flesh. If that girl had agreed to marry since, we wouldn't have this problem. You are taking medicine after that. That is just medicine after that. Neka refused the tradition. If she had refused to marry me, she could have gone back to her people. Can't go marry Tobiko. I can see you are determined to demonize the woman. Stop accusing me. Do you know why the money lender refused to lend us money? I suspect that Neka was owing him. You have no proof, or have you? You better arrange for another family meeting. Why should I suffer for a woman who refused authority and tradition? Oh, 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 oh. Is that your gross with her? Quit playing the ostrich. Do you know that she couldn't give my brother a son? Even the only daughter she had is on death. What a waste. It shall come on and cheer. It's, huh? it's a pity that Mr. Pity fall into a pit and no one cared to pity him. Ah, good morning, Honor. Good morning, Honor. Good morning. Are you sure you girls are still with me? Still with you? What do you mean we are still with you? Why didn't you tell me the princess came looking for me last night in your room? In your room? You mean our room? Why would the princess be looking for you in our room? Um, that means we must have been fast asleep. But, wait, why our room? Didn't you sleep in your room last night? Oh. Enough, just enough. Just get out of my way. Get out! Wow, wow. What's wrong with her? I don't know. Oh, Chupa Now, wow. Chiefs of Ibe. After careful consideration and a deep look into this matter at night, I have come to the conclusion that the girl in question did not intentionally kill that boy. I can see that it is a case of accident occasioned by the natural instinct of self-defense. And we have to be very careful, gentlemen. We must be careful so as not to have what they call miscarriage of justice in our land. Igwe! The ego himself. But uh, the implication of your words of wisdom is that we desecrate the laws of our forefathers. But, uh, but, uh, but uh, true, my dear. True. Uh, Obuma. Nananama. Eh? Uh, he who kills by the sword has always died by the sword. And by this, mudras have been very few and very far apart from Mbozolan. Uh, in the right to know, but we must not close our ears to the wisdom of the king, even though the boy had criminal motive. Did I hear you say criminal motive? Huh? You know not what you say. Mm. Can you prove it? Can you prove that he went in there to rape her? Were you there? And what was he doing in her house? Excuse me. I mean, the men fold no longer have right to visit the women in this kingdom. It's just what you want to Okay, tell. okay, okay. Tell me, why do you think she's starting? Does every woman you visit pick a knife and start the foolish talk? I say foolish talk! The man has been murdered and we're here talking sentiment. We should not allow sentiment to be cloud our sense of judgment. Yeah. Yeah. Knife energies. Knife energies. This girl in question does not deserve such mercy. Hmm? I mean, she does not have blue blood in her. <laughs> My brothers, I greet you all. Thank you. Thank you. Due to the issue at hand, 
We have tried to raise money for Neka's burial, but to no avail. The money lenders gave excuses that this is a planting season and there's nothing they could do to help us. Obi, Obi, what are we going to do now? Uh, we have resorted to selling properties, but the only property available for sale is this house. That's Obi. Your brother's house? Your own brother's house? Yeah, okay. You know, when I give me. Do you have uh, any option? Huh? Neka is dead. Uloma is about to be executed. So who will inhabit here? Okay, no, Chicha, Oyebieba. I have my own house, so I can go back to my house. <coughs> Mazobi, let me ask you this question. Ask him, Joanya. Are you telling us this thing for us to think over it? Or are you deciding that you are going to sell this <coughs> building off? Father, this is injustice at its worst. My jewel. The words one of your cabinet chiefs used on that girl was despicable. I don't understand. He called her a commoner. Father, the gods see us as equals. If we're not to incur the wrath of the gods, justice must be done to us all equally. Major, you have to know and understand where they're Father, coming from. We have to do the right thing. I do, my princess. I want to see the girl that lost her mother yesterday. Very well, then. This way. Oloma, my princess. Such a nice name. And you're beautiful too. Thank you, my princess. But of what use is beauty when my life will soon be snuffed out? It is a pity your mother didn't pull through. Accept my sympathy. My mother died because of me. And I'm going to die for the same sin. Look at me. Look into my eyes and tell me what you see. I... I see a... I see boldness. A confident and fearless princess. With a lot of dreams in her eyes. That is exactly what I want to see in your eyes. No matter who you are or the situation you find yourself in, you have to be strong. I have not come to give you hope, but I've come to give you courage. Hope is what you find for yourself. I want your eyes to sparkle because they are a reflection of your heart and people see your heart through your eyes. Uloma. Yes, my princess. You have to be strong. Thank you, my princess. I got my corona. If I am on a fool, I got my baggy bed, rap off a fool, a boy. Why him better day? Why he seek a yam boo boo
Live long, my king. You look gloomy, my father. Who was that man? He's a sentry from the outpost of our kingdom. Mm, obviously, didn't come with good tidings. My jewel. Evil is on the attack. And these people are desecrating the land. Do you know who they are? But they are obviously for Umula Kingdom. Umula Kingdom? I thought you maintained a healthy relationship with the king. Much more than that. We have intertraded for generations. Which is why it bothers me with these behaviors they have. What are you going to do now? That bothers my mind. Hmm. Uneasy lies the head that wears the crown. But father, I suggest you send emissaries to their kingdom. Their king should be able to put them in check. Right. But the trouble is, the king himself might not even know that his brigades are into mischief. Don't let that bother you. We should leave this to the prime minister to take care of. We already have too much to worry our heads with. Right. right. You're right. You're quite right. What would I do without you? You have seen the house. It is in excellent condition. Even uh, at the backyard, all the uh, we are it towards the other side, you see. So, so I bring money. It's very wonderful. Oh, be. Let me be in the position to determine that. Eh? After all, we have been going around the building and I've seen it by myself. And then, what do you think? Uh, not really. Obi, look at it. You just have to cut down the price a little bit. So that if I am buying it, I can pay you comfortably. No, eh? no, 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 no. If I Without do. any stress. If I do, the purpose will be defeated. Okay, I understand. Well, um, I will consider that. Hmm? And when I do, I will let you know. But the family are waiting to hear from me now. I will be... You will hear from me soon. <laughs> okay. After all, you hear from me soon. The place is okay. It's nice. So, like as I was saying, eh? Hey, Ichi. How are you doing? Ichi, I'm alright. I brought you some fruit. Ichi. I wanted to get some food and uh, water. But the medians are still awake. Take it. Take it. Ichi, thank you so much. I am so grateful. Thank you. I am so happy to see your spirit up once again. Well, thanks to you and the princess. Her words of encouragement has given me a ray of hope. Even if she said otherwise.
when that future comes, remember I love you. You love someone who would die in the morning if the king turns his mind this way. Oh, I love you so much, and I never believed you would die the first to die, so I love conquers death. Ichi, you invest in your heart in the grief. If you believe that I am going to stay alive, I mean, Ichi, you know. Again. Where have you been? What is it now? I was in the guard's room. Liar. I looked for you there, but I didn't see you. Okay. Maybe it was when I went to check on the Sally mates to see if the doors were locked. That is what you told me two weeks ago. Two weeks ago, you told me the same story. I hope you're not having an affair with any of the mates behind my back. Shh. Who be a dad? Huh? My love, how can you say things like that? You know it's only you. Right? It's only you now. Smile for me. Yesterday I waited here in bed. And today again you kept me waiting. Okay, it won't happen again. Oh, my love, my princess. No, I don't want that to happen again. It will not. Hmm? Maybe my Bad boy. You don't want me to like this for other people. Bad boy. Mm -hmm. such a feast going on in this kingdom? The feast is not far from sight, considering the season. Mm -hmm. My princess, you speak in parables. I greet you, my chiefs. The princess of the princess. Isn't it amazing that my father, his royal majesty, is so preoccupied with matters of the kingdom that he chooses to forget an important day such as this? Again, my princess, you are speaking in parables. My father, you have forgotten that today is my birthday. Oh, princess of Musa Kingdom. Good heavens! Hey! May the girls punish evil. My dear, I apologize. Perhaps the evil is getting old and bored. <laughs> to make up for my failing memory, I hereby declare today a day of feasting throughout the kingdom. Oh. Igwe! God, oh, oh, your majesty. <laughs> Summon all the caterers of the land. Let food be plentiful. Let drinks be inexhaustible. And call the musicians together with their harps and drums. And let my cheese stand to the music of the melody. Igwe! Thank you, my Have you had the my princess? <laughs>
The people of Ubuza land. Igwe! I thank you all for rejoicing with us. For even the birds of the sky is rejoicing with my jewel today. My jewel, who has been the source of strength and wisdom to me in this land. And as tradition demands today, I ask you to ask anything you want of me. I shall be given to you as tradition demands. I greet you all, my people. It is a thing of joy that I am the princess of Umbuzu Kingdom and my father's jewel. My father, I hope you will not be angry for what I'm about to ask you for. Angry, did you say? There is no anger. Where is anger on the day that the lions come first made the skin? There's nothing on this land today but joy. Joy. And no anger. Joy. Ask and it shall be given to you. I ask that Ulo be set free. There is so much treasure, golden treasure on this land. Land, properties, gold and silver. As for you shall have it. Not this. I have made my choice, my father. Very well done, my dear. As a king of a bosom land, and as tradition demands, I grant you your wish. Freedom. Thank you, sir. It is well with you. Now let the music begin, and let merriment continue. the princess right okay let's be going okay when you get there you talk to her yourself hero you're not princess you go Wait! The princess has just bought you your freedom. You have escaped our ass. You may not leave. Wait, 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 um, you, you, you mean that I... You mean that I can... 
<laughs> you are now a free girl. You can go now. You were right. You were so right. Yeah. You said you saw life in my eyes. You were right. <laughs> yes, but you should be smiling instead of crying. You know, I don't know what to do than to cry right now. That's the only expression I have in my heart, AJ. Okay. okay. Uh, it's the gods doing. The gods did it. All right? So, where are you going to now? I'm going to our house. Okay. Can I see the princess? I, I want to say thank you. Um, the princess is busy right now inside, okay? I'll help you talk to her then. I'll come to your house tomorrow to see how you're faring, all right? Okay, Jay. Yeah, you can go now. Thank you so much. May the gods reward you. Thank you so much. And the gods shall protect you as you need. It's your free. Go, go, go. I know. It's your free. I know. Oh, yeah, come on. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Go, before go. the king changes his mind. Run. Yeah. 
my life. I'm not dead. Oh, I am not dead. I am alive. I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm not dead. I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm not dead. I'm alive. Wait. I'm not dead now. I'm alive. Stop running. Stop running now. I'm alive. I'm not dead. I'm alive. Since we have all agreed to go and bring back our cups tomorrow for her better proper. The earlier we do it, the better for all of us. So anyway, there's no need wasting more time since we have uh, we have realized some money. Right, right. Mm -hmm. Um, then see, we all are still saying the same thing. No, we are not saying the same thing. Let's make arrangement concerning food and drinks. Okay. Oh, yeah. 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 Chalona, yeah. Chalona, yeah. Chalona, yeah. Chalona, Chalona, Chalona. Let us go on with this barrier and forget the issue of foods and drinks. Eh? After all, this is not a celebration of life or something else. Obi, Obi, I'm going to give up Obi. Nenyo Genyo. Nenyo Genyo. It has never been heard or seen in this entire community that anyone was buried without food and drinks. Even the poorest citizens. Tell him. Tell him. Okay, provide for it. Hmm? I said provide. Because going by my own estimate, foods and drinks are not accommodated. Go and provide for it. Obi, you are wicked. I mean, you are heartless, Obi. It was your mother. Uh, it's okay, oh, uh, No, no it has not got into that extent. It's okay, relax. Le no, 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 leave it. Okay. Let him talk to okay. me. I said, let him talk to you. Okay, once you go to the house, you go to the house. Okay, once you go to the house, you go to the house. Okay, once you go to the house, you go to the house. Okay, once you go to the house, you go to the house. Okay, once you go to the house, you go to the house. Okay, once you I'm, I'm sure these boys have a serious malaria or they are drunk. No, 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 my ass. This is serious. You saw a lost ghost. Hey! Oh no. You can't. Hey! She's alive, folks. Oh, long She's alive. Yes, I'm alive. Come on. Oh, 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 she has bewitched her way into freedom. After killing her mother. Why Look at it. She's a witch. I said it before. She's a witch. That's in the neighborhood. So enough of that, Obi. Instead of us to be happy that our daughter came back and stay alive. Yes. It was your mother. You don't see. Hmm? What interest do you have? I said what interest do you have? You are asking me. Yes. You are chasing flies out of somebody's asleep. You are crying louder than the bereaved. I suspect you. What are you doing there? Uncle, what is it? Don't uncle me. Uncle, what is it? Don't uncle me. Uncle, what is the matter? Are you deaf? Didn't I tell you to look for somewhere else to stay? That this house has been sold. And a buyer of this house uh, will take possession of this house after your mother's burial tomorrow. Well, I have heard what you have to say. I've heard it all. I've heard it. But I've decided to sleep in this house tonight to pack all the things I'll be needing. Mm. I, I really don't know where I'm, I'll be going from here. I don't even know. You better do. Because I will not warn you again. Anyway, let tomorrow come first.
Where are you? I don't even know where to go from here. Nobody will even have me in their houses. You know, can my sweet mother. A woman with a good heart and a good mind. Why did you die? Why did you die for me? Why? No one is even here to keep a vigil for you. Not even the women and daughters of this land. Mama, I will do it for you. I will keep a vigil for you, Mama. I will do it. Mama.
Where is she? Your Majesty. We have fine come the entire kingdom, but we couldn't find her. Now, what do you mean you couldn't find my daughter? Now, I will have you beheaded. If by sundown, my daughter is not here. But, my lord, would you listen to me? Blood will flow. If by sundown, she is not... My jewel, you almost gave me a heart attack. I am so sorry. I didn't mean to frighten you. Oh, I would have had this man beheaded if I didn't see you by sundown. No, that is why I made hay to return from Umula land. Umula land? You went to Umula land all by yourself? Had to, my father. Seeing that you were worried, you gave me a prized gift for my birthday. And the least I could do was to reciprocate. Father, I assure you, the crisis is over. My jewel, how did you pull through? All my diplomatic emissaries returned without results. I went for the heart of the land. Ah. The princess of Umula land has assured me that the two kingdoms will enjoy peace and friendship from now on. What all the men of valor and wisdom could not do. You have done a few hours. Now what would the kingdom have done without you? I knew the chiefs were not happy because you sent the girl away. Ah, so you are truly the heroine of the Mbuzu kingdom. Welcome back. Thank you, my father. Mba, your majesty. Summon the presence of all the chiefs at once. Yes, your majesty. Come.
my money has been stolen yet again and i believe as a matter of fact i know the thief is amongst you i give you four market days to find that money or else i will withdraw your benefits for this month hey, you... that is all i have to say I wonder who is that thief in this palace. You wonder? The princess should ask honor. After all, she is the chief maid. She is the only one that goes into her room. Ede, are you trying to say that I'm the thief? Ede! How can you be so blunt? Ede. Eh? Eche. You want Eche. Mulanyao. All I know, all I know that one day, one day we will get the culprit. One day we will get this culprit. Bam. That is my prayer soon. Hmm. Every time. I'm tired of all these things. All I know is that one day the boss will disgrace that disease. Ah, me and 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 you, you scared me to death. You know? I'm sorry, but uh, that's just why I summoned both of you. Anyway, uh, Uncle sold your house all because of her mother's burial. So, where is she staying now? At the uncle's place? Ah, uh, who agreed to stay with that witch? So, where is she? How can I see her? Well, I heard that she's staying around the Uguama forest. That's where she's staying now. Alone? How do I see her? Just before Google, there is an old abandoned thatched house that was deserted some years back. So that was where I saw her last week. I believe she'll still be there. Okay, okay, thank you very much. But uh, Eche, why are you still looking for her again? I thought that she has been released. Or did she commit another crime whilst in the palace? Eh? <laughs> you know that girl is evil nature. Oh, yeah, that, that. She did not commit any evil, evil, no crime at all. Um, I have a message I must deliver. Ah, um, what message? Let me ask. Why are you so keen to hear to hear a bad news about oh, that girl? Oh, oh, it's okay. Oh, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. You better be. Sorry, sorry. Sorry. Okay. My father. Ah, my jewel. This is Princess Ngui. The one and only daughter of King Muamala, the fourth of Umula Kingdom. Ah, the princess with the royal gate. You're welcome. Thank you, Your Highness. Please, sit down. I feel flattered. Don't be. It is true. Thank you, Your Highness. I'm very happy to be here today. I've heard so many wonderful things from my friend, your daughter, about you. When I got the message from the princess to help stop the conflict between your people and my people, I saw it as an opportunity, so I jumped at it. And I am glad I did. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Well, I must commend you, both of you, for a job well done, especially you. Princess Nguedo. Thank you, Your Highness. You are well commended. And um, how is your father, the king? He sent his regards. And his beautiful queen? She's well. Very good. You're welcome. Father, we will be in my chambers while we wait for lunch. We Very need well. to catch up on old times. Very well then. Excuse us. Thank you, Your Highness. Where you 
Steve. Well, this is where fate has bequeathed to me. No, here is lonely and deserted. Very dangerous for a woman. Anyone that has experienced the dread of the death roll, anywhere will be safe haven. Hey, who told you I was here? Well, I asked around and uh, they told me. I was told. I mean, I mean, but I still insist. Well, oh, here is very dangerous and it's not decent for a woman to leave. <sighs> the truth is, I have no choice. Who would want to have a murderer that managed to escape from execution? I know your mother is no more. Oh, but you can stay in the house without her. You can. Jay, it's a pathetic story. How? Jay, can't you just hear me? Can't you just hear what I'm saying? I don't have a choice. I don't have a house. So where were you staying before your ordeal started? I was staying in our house. In my late father's house. And so, why are you not there now? Why? My uncle sold the house to... to bury my mother. Your uncle sold the house to bury your mother? of my land have mercy on these people but, but at least they, they would have accommodated you who would want to accommodate a murderer who Ichi, they call me a witch an outcast no 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 you can't be a witch you can't possibly be a witch who no, no. you are not depressing yeah? you are I, I mean Never mind. Um, the gods do not close their ears to, to, the, to the plight of an outcast. Okay. So, how have you been managing? He is too. I mean. <laughs> you are so hilarious. I'm glad I can make Princess Iberia of all people laugh. Going on and on and on about Princess Ebi. What is so special about her? I'm not surprised you don't understand. Because you don't see your back. Mm. It's the people that sees your back that should tell you how it is. Mm. Yeah. So, what do people say Princess Ebi is? Mm. First, that she is wise and intelligent, mm. bold mm. and confident. And to cap it all, she is the daughter, the only daughter of the richest king from here to the coast. Oh, what makes Mbuzo Kingdom the richest? Are you asking? Okay, I'll tell you. In Umwala Kingdom, where I am from, the only thing that generates money for the king, my father, is the farm product and the ore market. That's all. Well, here we have the farm products and three markets Nkwa, Afo and Wangene which operates for four market days plus the kingdom treasures so, this is why I say your kingdom is the richest well I never really thought of that well what does it matter sooner than you think I'll get married and I'm not going to my husband's house with all these treasures. He <laughs> <It> does. <laughs> Lunch is served. Thank you very much. I'll join you shortly. All right, my princess. Mm. Princess Nguedo, lunch is served. What are we waiting for? Let's hit it. Let's go and eat. <laughs> Thank you very much for honoring us with your presence. I only wish you would spend the night with me. Princess, I wish I can, but I can't. I promised the queen, my mother, that I shall return to the kingdom today, so I have to go back. But I promise to visit you very soon. That's all right. Thank you once again for coming. No, I should be the one thanking you for the wonderful meal. Your hospitality. I hope you enjoyed yourself. I enjoyed every bit of my stay with you. That's good. Thank you. 
Hmm. Princess, do accept this. It Thank is from you. my heart. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. And this is for you. Yeah. I hope you like it. No, I love it. This is beautiful. Yes. Thank you very much. You're welcome. See you very soon. I hope to see you soon. Take care of you. Just cooperate with us. We are not like that boy. Stop. If you refuse, we will have our way and then finish you up. Do you understand? I beg you, I beg you, don't do this to me. I cooperate. beg you. You will enjoy it. And yet, we can give you some meat instead of this canals. Eh, what? I don't want meat. I don't want meat. I'm okay with my canal. I don't want meat. Please, I beg you. I just lost my mother. Please, I beg you. Don't do this to me. <laughs> we know. Please. But one question. Do you want to lose yourself? No, I don't want to lose myself. I don't want to lose myself. Please, I beg you, don't do this to me. I beg you. I beg you, please, don't do this to me. I beg you, please, come on, please, go. Hold on. I hope those rascals did not hurt you. No, they didn't. Hey, Eche, thank you so much. It's thank you good. so much, Eche. Thank you so much. I'm thankful. Thank you. I, I told you here is very dangerous. I told you. Why does everyone want to rape me? Why? Why? I mean, it is a clear picture. It's obvious you're a beautiful woman. You are. That's why. May the gods bless you for me. May the gods bless you for me. Hey, Chief, if you didn't come here, another incident would have happened. Thank you so much, Chief. Thank you. I keep to check on you and bring you some meat. Right. Okay. Eche, thank you so much. So tell me, how is the process? You know I've not shown my gratitude to you. Well, that is not in a hurry. The most important thing here right now is your accommodation. That's the most important thing. Eche, an outcast is an outcast. You are not. Eche, you still haven't told me what is taking you out of the palace this time. Yeah, I told you, you know about my father's illness now. My father is sick and I told you about it. Yeah, I thought he's okay and I thought he's better now. He's not better. He's even getting worse every day. This time, in fact, I just need to take care of him once and for all. Yeah. I, I need some money. I need some money to take care of him. Uh -uh, now, Eche. I just gave you some money last week. Last week. I know the money has been used. Don't you understand? I just need some more, man. Uh, oh, Where will I get the money from now? Eh? Where? I don't know. Well, I'm equally as confused as you are. That's the truth. I don't know what to do now. This this old man may just. I don't know. How have you been faring? Well, my princess, it's not been very easy, especially those my mother owed before she died. But I thank the gods that I've finally been able to pay them, thanks to a friend of mine who helped me. How did you get that necklace? 
Oh, a friend of mine gave it to me. A friend? Yes, my friend. I see. Okay, my princess. Thank you. I give you 30 minutes. 30 minutes to search the entire room and get me that jewelry box with the jewelry. This does not include the monies I've been getting missing in this palace. get this necklace? Was it before or after you were released from the cell? I, I got it last week. A friend of mine gave it to me. My princess, do you like it? My princess, you can have it. I can give it to you. Take it. What jewelry? She just woke up and said, What happened? She I don't just... know. Someone came looking for the princess. And we went out to see the person. She came back to her room and asked me to find the jewelry in 30 minutes. I don't know. Maybe she wants to give it to the girl. We are finished. We are doomed. Honestly. Hey, Ashuda. Hey, Ashuda. Ashuda, please. Hey. The princess. Hey. We are dada. The princess wants to see you now. She says I must come with you immediately. Eh, uh, Bede, tell her I'll be with her in a jiffy. No. Osimba. Munai Now. Hey. What is happening now? Hona. Hona. Let's go. Your sword. Say again. This thing is unfair. I drop one more. You got to go. I drop one more. I'm not afraid of no one. 
Oh, if I if I can have it. Such is life. Ede. Mm -hmm. uh, you can come around anytime. Anytime you come around, you peep through that hole, eh? We will always see to your problems, eh? Okay? Meanwhile, eh, take care of her. Okay, I'm going to leave her. I don't Thank you very much. The ghost will surely reward you. Mm -mm. They will not reward you for stealing from the princess you were meant to protect as a chief maid. But I was doing it for the butterflies. Butterfly, for you, no, For the butterflies, Eche. You promised me you were going to get married as soon as we are relieved from our job. I was stealing from the princess and giving it to you for you to plan our wedding. Sweet melody. Because we we'll be... reward you. Mm -mm, they will not reward you. See, Biko, Biko, honor. Honor. Allow me to plan myself. Let me just go and pick my pieces. Biko, go to your father's house. I cannot go to my mother's house. So. Eh. <laughs> Mark again. What will I tell them? That I did, I made the princess relieve me of my job. Tell them everything. Tell them how you follow Eche, bomba to bomba in the palace. Okay, ne? Anyway, I'm going to, I'm going with you, Eche. Eh? I'm going with you. Anyway, I'm going, I'm going with you. Make work with you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going with you. Make work with you. Move on, man, Eche. Move on, man, yeah. I'm going with you. <laughs> <laughs> Father, please, I want you to accept her as a maid in the palace. My jewel, what happened to Anna, your chief maid? She got me upset. And you sacked her. Now, what makes you so sure that this one would not be worse than Anna, considering her background? I can't tell, but there's something. There's a voice inside of me that says she's she's okay. She won't betray me. A voice in you. <laughs> well, my jewel. Since after I lost your mother during the birth of Ilama, my primary responsibility has been to keep you happy. I think I've tried my best. All I'm saying is, think twice and be sure that this is what you want. I made my choice, Father. This is what I want. And you are sure about that? Yes, Father. Very well. You may have her then. Thank you, Father. Thank you so much. Anything for you. Now, tell me. Tell me what offense Honor and Etsy committed to make you relieve them of their duties. Promise you would not interfere in my judgment. My job. You have to let me know your response first before I give you my words. I am still the king of this land, remember? Okay. I will tell you. Good. Eche! Eche! How could you do this to me? How could you do this to me? How could you steal from the princess to give to me? Oh! You want to send me back to the cell, right? No, you... How can you say such a thing? You know I love you and care for you. I, I should have told you not to wear it to the palace. And that's the only mistake I made. Honor said that you promised her marriage. That was what made her steal from the princess to give to you. I don't mind that fool. At her age, she's still playing the fool. I can't marry her now. Eche, I thought you were sensible. Now I know your type. I love you. What have I done now? Ah! Bam, 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 bam. Don't you call me your love again. Don't you call me your love again. Don't you try it. That was the same thing you were calling Honor. When you promised her marriage, now you are calling her a fool. Eh? Don't call me your, your love again. That's not what you think. It's not it. I, I, I mean it. It's not. Eche, leave my house! Leave my house! Eche, I said leave my house. Oh, oh, it's me, Eche. It's me. I have a new life at the palace. Leave my house! Leave my house. Eche, I am warning you. Hey. I don't want to push you. <laughs> Eche, I'm warning you. Leave my house. Eche, leave my house. Oh, oh it's me. Eche. I greet you all. Honor my chief maid has been relieved of her duties, both as chief maid and as maid in this palace. I'm sure you must have caught wind of the news, but that's not the reason I called you here. If you notice, there's someone new in your midst. Not so new in the palace, but new because of the duty she's about to assume. I want you to take her as your own, coach her, 
and get along with her. If there's anything that needs my urgent attention, you know where to find me. Thank, Thank you, my you princess. princess. Your final. I can't believe that Ona just left the palace like that. As for me, I think they are paying for their sins. Serves them right. Ah, oh, Mama, please let's forget about that. EJ, I don't like your mood. Is that why you're this gloomy? Even if the princess wants to employ a new maid, not that murderer. Iji, Biko, you are your voice, please. Well, if you ask me, I will say the gods have chosen to favor her. Favor her? Yes, favor her. That girl, she's an opportunist. An opportunist? Yes. Why did you say that? <laughs> Before you know it now, they will make her the chief media. I will be taking orders from her. <laughs> Is that your problem? Mm. Mm. You think it's funny? After all, it's both of us she would toss around. Okay. Let me ask you one question. What? Do you want to be the head? <laughs> what? <laughs> Please, so. What does it matter if she's made the shift media? I don't see anything wrong with it though. Or is there anything wrong with it? Yes. I want to rest. Her royal majesty. You are here lying down while we are outside walking, Abby. But, but I thought I did my portion before coming in here. And who told you that we share job in this palace? EJ, please. What? I can't remember we came here for a fight. Mm-hmm. What? Oh, oh no. Even though you were done with your bit, you should have at least waited for us a little bit before coming into the room. It's not nice now. Okay, I am I am sorry, okay? I apologize to you both. I am really sorry. I I, I didn't mean to dis disregard you both. That is what is expected for an upstart. EJ! Mm -hmm. EJ! What? She just apologized. Mm -hmm. So leave the poor girl alone! Do you know what? My problem now is that I want to sleep. And I will appreciate it if you guys will just keep quiet. Let me see if I can sleep, please. Do you know what? Get up. I want to dress the bed. Get up. Ije, what is wrong with Get you? Get up! Ije, I dressed this bed before lying on this bed. I dressed it. I what is wrong with you? I said you should get up. Are you deaf? Get up! Okay, okay, okay. I'll, I'll get up. Ah, ah. Ije, easy. Ije, easy. We don't want you. Easy. Yeah. Ah. Ije, why are you always doing this to me? I don't know I'm now. I don't know I'm now. Why are you always doing this to me, Ije? Why? Hold on. Just a boy there. Don't mind this girl. She's a troublemaker. She's hey. a little It's not fair. No, it's I'm not, not fair. a troublemaker. Yes. Okay. Please, I want don't to worry. sleep. Okay, go sleep. Put in your body yourself. I don't like all that. I don't like it. It's not fair. Don't mind her. How are you copying? Do you like your job? Like? <laughs> my princess, I love my job. Like is an understatement. My story is that of prison to palace. Only the gods know how grateful I am to you, my princess. I am really grateful. The gods are wise. You seem such a proper girl and I have no regrets. My princess, thank you so much. I mean, this words can send one to heaven. <laughs> I'm so grateful. I mean them. 
Just don't give anyone any reason to think I made a mistake. I understand, my princess. But I will never disappoint you. And if I do, let the earth open and swallow me. I will never do that to you, my princess. You gave me life. When I look into your eyes, I believe you. It's just that I'm wary of anyone around me, especially after Honor's birthday. I understand, my princess. So, how would you love to be chief maid? My princess, your chief maid? My princess, I, I don't deserve this honor. I do not deserve it. I am so grateful. I, I am going to be your chief maid. Thank you so much. I'm so grateful. Thank you so much. May the gods bless you for me. Thank you so much. Thank you. That means your monthly benefit will increase. Your room will be better, and life will generally be okay for you. May the gods bless you, my princess. Thank you so much. I hope there's no new teeth in this palace. No. <laughs> no. Well, I I don't know how to say this. I don't know how to say this. Okay, fine. Start from the beginning. Or better still, begin from the ending. Okay, fine. I'll say it, okay? I'll say it. Um <laughs> I'm talking now. Okay, um, The princess just made me her She made it! <laughs> I said it. Udo and Uma were laughing. Look at it now. <clears throat> oh, I'm so happy for you. You're a lucky girl. Oh. Thank lucky, you. <laughs> lucky girl, my foot. She's an opportunist. Look, girls. She has warmed her way over us. <clears throat> <clears throat> Let's go and answer the princess first. Till we come back. Oh my god, Udo, I'm so happy for you. Thank you so much. Thank you. So much. I'm going up. Pull up. Don't mind whatever anyone says to demoralize you. An opportunity comes but once. Once it's lost, it can never be regained. Come on, it's your turn to shine. Cheer up! I'm so happy for you! Thank you so much. Yes. Oh, that's the thing. Yes! <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Greetings, my father. <laughs> what was it the cabinet deliberated on for so long today? I hope the kingdom is not on fire. My jewel, this flame burns deep from the heart. I see. Same old story. What do they want you to do this time? Give them an heir to the throne. An heir to carry on with the kingdom when I'm long gone. Well, you're not going anywhere anytime soon. That I know. But all the same, my jewel, they have a point. They always have a point. And it's time we did something about it. Father, mother has been gone for so many years now. You can't keep her in your memory forever. Ah, oh, wish Ulama was not born the way he is. There is no use crying over spilled milk. It is time to act.
My king, we understand that you love the late queen dearly and that you will choose to remain like this without taking another wife until you take your last breath. But it is unfortunate because you are the king. In our kingdom, according to our customs and our tradition, kingship is not by appointment. Kingship is not contested for. Yes. Kingship is inherited. Good, good. Yes, sir. And uh, my brother and my king, Mbuse, time waits for no one. You are getting older by the day, not younger. Come to think of it. Your Highness, I wonder what will be the fate of this kingdom if anything happens to you. But may the gods forbid. Oh. Alright. Now in that case, what do you all suggest that I do? <coughs> My king. <laughs> Very simple. Marry another wife that will give you a male child that has send you a throne mm -hmm. when you are gone. Haven't I spoken well, my elders? Love, 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 You have all spoken well. Hmm? You have all spoken well. Because I am sure you all have my good interest at heart. But there is a reason, a need, for me to also consider the interest of my only princess. Remember, jealousy may set in here. Yes, of course. My brother, I agree with you. But it is natural for her to be jealous. After all, she's a young girl and she won't find it funny. Watch a young lady that could be of her age come into the kingdom to take over her mother's position. Uh, more so, when you consider the kind of uh, relationship that is existing between both of you. I understand this, but that is by the way. Something must be done about it. And it's urgent, my king. That is true, my king. But what ought to be done? What ought to be done? done? to bother you, my prince, but I want to know what makes the only prince of Mbuzu kingdom unhappy. I have helped them stay in this, in this palace, but I, the great, great Alama, cannot leave, leave his community as a king that I, after his father be the king, king, king has had done his ancestors. Is that what makes my prince sad? It is. It is enough for they will not make, make me cry. My, my prince, my, please my prince, don't let that bother you, okay? You are the only prince of this kingdom. Destiny can never be changed. Now, can my prince be happy once more? Let me sing for you, my prince.
My princess, is everything all right? Get me a strong drink. A very strong one. I need to drink and drown my sorrows away. But my princess, no matter what the problem may be, I mean, getting drunk will not solve the problem. It will only make matters worse. I said, get me a drink. My now! Princess Olaido. The Princess of Obolo Duku Kingdom. The daughter of His Royal Highness, King Ododo IV of Obolo Kingdom. You are welcome to our land. Thank you. Princess, you know why you are here. Should you become the Queen of Mbuzu Kingdom, what will be your primary objective? <laughs> In my father's house, we are blessed with so many children, both male and female. And that is what I, Princess Oledo, have come to transfer to the great king of Ubuzi kingdom. I will bear him so many children and also make him a happy man as long as he lives. Thank you. You may see. Princess Wama is my name. I'm the one and only daughter of King Uduma of Aloma Kingdom. I'm here to marry King Umbuze of Umbuzu Kingdom. And I'm here to bear him and her to his strong. And as I do that, I want him to reciprocate by establishing a cordial relationship with my people and by his power and influence to help develop my land. Thank you very much. You may sit. It is only a newborn baby that doesn't know or heard of the one and only princess Bima. The beloved daughter of King Akaloku, daughter of Ugwama. Thank you, Princess. We all know who you are. Why are you here? It's simple. I've come to bear him a male child. Since his dead wife was only able to give him a daughter and an incomplete son. You speak blasphemy. Shut up and get out now! Just like that. Just like that. Get out before I get the guards to throw you out. I'm a princess in my land where I come. Get out! Look at her. Foreign entity. I am Princess Uzondu of Ibube land. The only daughter of Iwendo Katsu of Ibube kingdom. Thank you, Princess Uzondu. Why are you here? I'm here to marry King Mbuze of Mbozo Kingdom and to make up for his late wife's lapses. Would you sit down? Shut up and sit down. How dare you come here to insult the entire kingdom of Mbuzo? Imagine. I am princess. Shut up! Sit down, you silly aunt. Me too. Yes, you too. Silly aunt. Sit down. As a matter of fact, all of you get out hey. now. Oh. Now. Oh. Rubbish. What bridge? Are they from this planet? I am Princess. <laughs> My father is downcast. It is understandable after yesterday's humiliating experience. My Jew. It is hammer ten season out there. Yet the clouds seem to gather around me. No, father. You are like an eagle that soars above the clouds like a colossus. But today, this eagle feels like a sparrow. A sparrow whose nest has been destroyed by the torrential rain. 
when the river is at its lowest ebb, the fish don't quit swimming. You are the roaring lion of Mbuzu land. How can mere Jesus upset you? Tomorrow, my friend will be here. Your friend? Yes, the princess of Umula land. Ah, your friend, yes. That extraordinary Giselle. And when you take her hand in marriage, the relationship between the two kingdoms will be cemented eternally. Hmm. Well, you know, I, I wonder why you have not thought about her before now. She is my friend. I'm bringing her here because the situation demands. Hmm. My jewel, you know, you are like a storm that blows good things towards this kingdom. You are a bringer of good tidings. <laughs> My father's spirit will be lifted. Yes. And I very happy. Yes. <laughs> and joy. So, my dear, that is my story. And since I'm obviously not getting any younger, I know I need to get a wife that will bear me a male son who will be the heir to my throne. And that is why I sent for you. I've heard you, Your Highness. But I need to have a word with my friend privately before getting back to you. Very well then. That'll be alright. Thank, Thank you, Highness. You're welcome, Princess. I'll be back. Princess. I'm sure you're wondering why I said I wanted to see you privately. Exactly. <sighs> I'll go straight to the point. Your father wants an heir. That is why I sent for you, because you are my friend and I see you as someone who is responsible and wise. I need you to help me guard my father's throne. That settles it. You get what you want and I equally get what I want. How do you mean? Come on, princess. You don't expect me to marry your father and give him an heir just like that. I know you have a strong bond with your father. I marry your father and tomorrow you throw me out of the palace. What becomes of my fate? How could you think of such a thing? Let's face facts. You know it's true. I'm not saying I won't marry your father for the sake of our relationship, but I want you to give me something in return. You know, I'm talking about my security here. Now you're talking. I'll marry your father on the condition that he crowns me the queen as soon as we get married. That is settled. If you marry my father, you automatically become the queen of Mbuzu Kingdom. Uh, okay, that's nice to know, but that's not all. What again? I want 10 acres of land from the land at the boundary between your kingdom and my kingdom. The gods of my father. Princess, that's still not all. I want you to tell your father to give me one-fifth of Umbuzu kingdom's treasure as a gift. Then, I will marry him and give him an heir to the throne of Umbuzu. Kingdom. you are not different from the rest of them all. Come on, princess. I'm being practical here. Let's face it. Your father dies. A stranger ascends his throne. And what becomes of your fate? Ebiri, think. Think.
My prince, I have kept your food. Okay. Thank you very much. My prince, you don't need to thank me. It's my obligation to serve you as long as I'm in this palace. Hello. My prince. Yeah. You're not the only, only maid in this, this palace. Yeah. You, the tire as, as long as you can to, 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 to make me happy. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Eh? You're welcome, my prince. But please, my prince, stop thanking me for discharging my duties. My friends, come and have his meal now. <laughs> before we were even born. Though we have to try our best, but we can never run faster than our shadows. My princess, I want you to wipe your tears. Tomorrow will take care of itself. My princess, if you're like this, how do you want the king to be? You're supposed to be his strength in times like this. My princess, I beg you, please wipe your tears and get yourself together. Okay. You speak with so much wisdom. For your age and background, I'm impressed. Thank you. Thank you, my princess. You have taught me a lot of wisdom since I started saving you in this palace as a maid. I owe you the credit. I just want to see my father. Okay. at first and I told her so but on a deeper reflection I came to the conclusion that destiny is one thing mortals do not have control over what do you mean you really think I should do that if we don't we will be ridiculed if we do we we'll just have to wait for the gods to guide us and we'll put this thing behind us once and for all but my chiefs, but they don't have to know. You feed them what they chew. Life is hard. Destinies are inevitable. My princess, there'll soon be here. Good morning, my princess. Good morning, my princess. Good morning. How's your day? Good morning. I called you all here to help in preparing a very special meal for three in 30 minutes. Good. That'll be all. You'll be now leaving. 
me. Always stay back to help me with something. Talking about all this time. <laughs> EJ, what is it again this time? What is it again? Hmm. Can't you see that that opportunist has finally succeeded in buying the princess heart? EJ, let me ask you what is it that this girl did to you in this palace? Every time Ulo did this, Ulo did that, what is it? Just listen to yourself, you fool. Me? Yes. Fool? Yes. Look at this primitive swine. Are you mad? <laughs> Hey. Wait, 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 EJ, do you realize that in this life, some people are more likable than the others? Okay, hmm. what you're trying to say is that she's more likable than me, eh? Exactly. Some people are more likable than others. So stop prognosing into people's affairs and mind your business. That is how you keep complaining. Honor oh, did this. Honor oh, did that. Honor. Oh, Shut up! Mm. At least what I suspected was the truth. Hmm? She finally turned out to be the thief in this palace. Well, EJ, it is not going to work for you this time around concerning Olo. Ah, yes. Just wait and see. Can we just stop this craze and do the work assigned to us by the princess? I wonder. She gave us 30 minutes and we've been rambling like mad women. What? what? Ah. Ah. No, 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 calm down. I back. said it. Um, it's okay. Mm? Okay, Fiji, calm down. I'll not be fine. Calm down, relax. Besides, we have something to do. We're here talking. It is no longer news that the king has taken a new wife and queen in the person of Princess Nguedo, who is also my friend. I summoned you all here to formally introduce her to you. She is your queen. You're welcome, You're welcome my lady. Thank you all. I am happy to be a part of this great kingdom. I have come in peace. And in pursuit of a goal, we all share together, which is to move this palace forward. I pledge my cooperation, and I ask that you cooperate with me so that peace and harmony will reign in the palace as the gods blesses us with long life and prosperity. Thank you all. Thank, Thank you, my queen. Gods, you may leave. Maids, stay. Thank, Thank you, my princess. Thank, Thank you, my lady. Now, the lady will choose who amongst you she desires to be her chief maid. My lady. My princess. That will not be necessary. I find your chief maid interesting. Ulo? Yes. I want her. As you please. I elevate Udo to Ulo's position. Thank you, my lady. You may leave. What? What is it, Kaka? 
can get speak. Speak to us! Or you're about to be cost. Oh yes. Our ears are open. You may go. When I'm elder, he grinding the molars of his teeth. You know that something is happening in the spirit realm. No. What is it? My king, she get back to his sleepborn. Hey! No! Ha! Mbam! Abambu! Otunogwe! Abambu! Otunogwe! Oh, girls of my sisters. Why? Why do you have fixed me with such pain? Something troubles the eagle. Nigel, only the lies the head that wears a crown. And this crown is getting heavy by the minute. Hmm. Is there something I have missed out? Do you ever miss anything in this kingdom? Her time is near. You surprise me, my father. Instead of you to rejoice in anticipation of what is about to happen, you worry your head over nothing. Ah, old memories are hard to erase, my dear. And I am not getting any older. My father, where lies your faith? 